Hello there, fellow human, or I hope. Welcome back to Universe Sandbox. We're going to be today playing with Universe Sandbox, and we're going to specifically be playing with rings. Because last time we played with the rings, and it was a lot of fun. So if if you like it, you gotta put a ring on. <laughs> Does that apply to planets? Is Jupiter the one? Wait, no, there are many more planets that have rings in our solar system than just Jupiter. Never mind, I, I take it back. I take it back. Wait, no, that's Saturn. I was I didn't even say the right planet. What is wrong with- See, this is what happens when you're doing homework for hours. You get the planets mixed up. Alright. What if we gave Jupiter a ring of Earths? I don't think I could actually physically get enough. You know what? It'll still be a ring of Earths, whether or not it's functional and fully complete Earths. It may be just absolutely wrecked and ripped apart Earths, but that's still Earths, right? You know, if you say Earth that many times, it stops sounding like a real word and it just starts getting a little bit confusing and worrying. But it's okay because none of it matters anyways. Because we're all about to die 80 times over in the greatest, the greatest death ever when Earth gets consumed by Jupiter 87 times. Actually, I can almost bet you this is not 87. It's quite a few Earths, and the amount of death and destruction here is going to be on a scale never seen before in human history. But we're still not quite to the level of death that there is the level of cringe on TikTok, so we're not quite at limitations of the universe. Now, if you're wondering if anything I've said in the past 10 minutes has any real meaning, then you wouldn't know because the video isn't even 10 minutes long. <laughs> Alright, and yes, I do have problems. And no, I don't know where they come from. Alright, we've got Jupiter having a very nice ring of Earths now. It kind of looks like a star, that's the design I was going for. Um, this Earth is, for some reason, chilling much lower than the rest, so we'll just murder it because if you don't conform, that's what happens in society. And we live in a society. So now let's see how society treats all of these Earths. Wow, there's been no death or destruction yet, isn't there? Oh, damn. Alright. Actually, no, that just hit in the middle of the Pacific. Just some irrelevant islands like Hawaii. Who cares about them anyways? <laughs> okay, now people in California in- Oh god, never mind. Uh, also Africa, all- all dead. California, dead. Uh, if you live on the East Coast like cool people do, then you might be fine. If you're in England, you're also dead. But, I mean... England. Alright, we got a few Erds that have not been destroyed or hit yet. I'm surprised the Tidal Forces have- Oh, never mind, the Tidal Forces have started ripping the Erds apart. It just seems the Erds are busy smashing each other- I mean, smashing into each other. Shut up. <laughs> okay, uh, the Earth Ring is... I don't know, a few of the Earths seem to be doing fine. I mean, after the initial loss and death and destruction, it looks like we've got a few good contenders. Oh my god. Like, yeah, oh no! What were the chances? What were the chances they would collide like that? Actually, they were 100% because it did in fact happen. Alright, Jupiter is like, I am going to consume all of you and I will not regret one bit of it. But that's okay. You know, sometimes that's just how the mood is. And it looks like there are three Earths left in the Earth Ring. Um, they seem to do be doing pretty well, though. I, I won't lie. Uh, this is impressive. Look, look at them go. I mean, they're getting kind of. Oh my God! What are the chances? Still 100% because it happened. <laughs> All right. Um, uh huh. Looks like we have one Earth left, and I think this one will actually survive for all of eternity, so... Congratul- it's technically- I oh no, there we go. Earth! It's, uh, 2.39 Earths in mass, because it kind of ate the other ones. And it's at 2,000 degrees, 
but some of you would be happy in that kind of temperature anyway, so it's fine. It must have gotten hit by something because the temperature kind of spiked up again. Ah, I would know a lot about spikes because I'm a spike viper. All right, so we're going to have to speed things up a bit more. Um, so I will do that in order to let it cool down. Don't worry, guys, it's only been 23 days. Wow, it only took me 23 days to kill like 100 billion people. I'm up for hire. <laughs> if that's your thing, is killing a lot of people quickly in a simulation, then I can really help. Dude, that picture of Earth kind of looks like an old guy wearing sunglasses. If you don't see it, I'm sorry, but it kind of does look that way. I can add another object? Oh, I can add Jupiter. <gasps> Whoa, that makes the graph so meaningless. <laughs> nice. God, I love meaningless graphs. Okay, uh, the Earth is now at 500 degrees. It just kind of staying steady at 500 because of the heat being exerted on it from Jupiter, you know, Jupiter's tidal force. But just because the average temperature is 500 doesn't mean it all is. Like, it gets as cold as... Oh no, it, it goes from 900 to 500. Never mind. Why is there water on the surface? That's that's pretty impressive. There's just like molten lava, water. Damn. I guess if you are like right over here, you could take a nice bath. Oh no, that's lava. Where is the nice bath water? Gamer bath water right here. See right there? That's it. Meet me there. We will build a beautiful bathhouse. <clears throat> Earth is still getting hit from projectiles that came off of the other Earths. Um, I am convinced if I set the surface temperature down to like zero, it will very quickly gain back again. Yes, yes it is. But will life come back for a moment? Oh my God! I don't even know what these land masses are anymore. Um, I think that used to be Africa. I, that, that is certainly the United States. You will notice a distinct lack of the center of the United States, but honestly, this is the cool part anyway. Wait, no, that's Mexico over here. Oh god, no, there's no Florida- oh god, the East Coast, no! <laughs> oh, we're gone. Damn, all that's left is the Louisiana Purchase. <laughs> How did the French know? Wait, why did they sell it if they knew? They, they could have kept it and been the last ones alive. And why? Really interesting how we just can have these borders drawn out. I don't really know what's going on here. Like, why are there these shapes? Is this the shape of an actual country? This kind of looks like Spain, but that doesn't make sense. Wait, does it make sense? Is it the tilt that's getting me all confused? That's all right. No, that's definitely Spain because that's the UK. All right. Yeah, it's the tilt that's getting me confused. So let's just tilt Earth back, because that'll certainly fix all the problems. There we go, and if we rotate it this way... Oh, wow! It looks like only the coasts survived. It's like negative global warming danger. Don't worry, guys, you may be ten feet underwater, but that'll save you when we're ten feet under lava. Ah, see? You weren't thinking about your the positives. Um... Saudi Arabia actually doing pretty good though, and what else do we have? Oh damn, now it's upside down. Yeah, the Earth's spin is kind of screwed. Oh no! Oh, I hate it when another meteorite strikes. That's awful. So awful, right? So terrible. Okay, Jupiter, let's just turn you into... 100% hydrogen and just slowly decrease your density until Earth dies. Because we need to end this. We need to end the pain and suffering. Oh, I didn't mean that quickly. Damn it. Jupiter. It's alright. I know how to deal with this. Have you ever been eaten before? All you have to do... Oh. Okay, uh... There we go. Oh, nice! Oh wait, it's not enough? Really? Wow, I was under the impression that this is much more overkill than it actually is. Hmm, alright, um, let's just do like 
times 10. Yeah, okay, that'll do. No, really? Jupiter, what the heck, man? Uh, we're, we're trying to end the video. Okay, we're getting some cool patterns here, but like... You are really... Oh, it's probably because the simulation is just running so quickly. No, it's not really running that quickly. What the heck? Jupiter, how are you displacing all this heat? The radius of this laser is the sun. Okay, now Jupiter is shrinking. This provides for good video ending-ness. Hey guys, you should like and subscribe, otherwise you will turn out like Jupiter shot with a giant laser. If that sounds like a cool thing to do, it's not. It's very warm, actually, I can promise. Unless we used the cold laser. But we aren't. So thank you all for watching. Leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Or will we? I don't know. Why am I reaching to shut off my lights? I haven't even stopped recording yet.